Stafford Police Department. Line is being recorded by Sean. Hey, we've had some break-ins in my neighborhood, and there's a real suspicious guy. This guy looks like he's up to no good, or he's on drugs or something. Did you see what he was wearing? Yeah, a dark hoodie, like a gray hoodie, and either jeans or sweatpants and white tennis shoes. Yeah, now he's coming towards me. Okay. He's got his hand in his waistband. And he's a black male. Are you following him? Yeah. Okay, we don't need you to do that. Zimmerman is a racist, a child killer. Florida tolerates it. He a wannabe cop, I swear. He dialed 911 46 times in the past eight years. Six is last year. To no avail, one never recall. He complained about a black male. Trayvon was buying iced tea and some Skittles. Zimmerman chased him to his death with a pistol. How can you scream self-defense when you had nothing to defend yourself against? The dispatcher told him not to follow. He pursued with a 9mm and called him a fucking coon. A coon is short for raccoon in the slavery days. That's what they call black dudes. Whoever don't help is guilty. Why? Because he cried for help. His last words was help me. They got a law called Stand Your Ground, which put a 17-year-old young man in the ground. Geraldo said black kids shouldn't wear hoodies. Compare the hoodie to a killer. How could he? Sean Bell ain't wear a hoodie and they still shot him. Diallo ain't wear a hoodie and they still shot him. What's wrong with Geraldo's brain? The Ku Klux Klan wear hoods and nobody complains. Let them keep killing our kids. We have no future. Vigilante shooters. They say since it happened, Skittles made money in stock. My applause, I hope they donate some of that money to the cause. Obama stepped up, so did Al Sharpton. R.I.P. Trayvon Martin, Police Chief Bill Lee. Justified the murder, then he stepped down from his position. No more further. <laughs> 